We better take one from top to bottom. We need to make sure that there's not something I'm not seeing here. Knox is a puppy with a badly injured hind leg that he got while roughhousing with his owner's dad. This little guy's in a lot of pain, and he's not even using his hind leg at all. Can you sit him up and shoot it like this? Oh, there it is. It's fractured. These long bones right above the paw, they're called metatarsals, and three of them are fractured. No wonder you can't use your paw. In a lot of dogs, fractures like these need surgery. But because Knox is a puppy, I don't think that's necessary here. OK, back to the table we go. Instead, we can just stabilize that hind leg so it can heal on its own. But before we can do that, I need to reset the bones so they can heal back in place. I'm actually going to set these little bones. I'm going to pull them and put them straight. And pull them, put them straight. That felt good. I felt the bones actually move right back into place. The next thing we're going to do is that splint. Is that going to be just the right size? I got an award for the best bandager ah. my senior year of vet school, and Erin didn't. <laughs> I remind her every time we put a splint on. <laughs> on puppies, they can outgrow a cast, and so we sometimes just do splints and splint changes. There we go, Lori. I still yeah. got it. Yeah, that looks good. Good. All right, let's call the owners. Buddy. Oh, he looks so sad. <laughs> it's okay. Hey. Uh... Well, he has three broken bones in that leg. There's metatarsal bones, so that would be kind of like the top of our foot. Oh, okay. And he has a splint on, and it stabilizes that whole leg. He needs to keep that splint on. And then I'll have you come back in a few weeks, and we'll recheck him. All right? Okay. I know that <laughs> sounds like a long, long time, but all of a sudden, we'll snap our fingers, and it'll be over. Okay. Come here, baby. It feels so good to have Knox back. I think the cone in the cast will slow him down a little bit, but he'll get pretty accustomed to it pretty fast. You guys, puppies are resilient. We just need to give them a little bit of time and love. And remember, make sure you don't blame your dad for this too we badly. We won't. We All won't. Right. We gave him enough crap last night for it. So. <laughs>